Medicine Lake is no doubt a popular site for fishing and boating. But water levels are affecting summer enjoyment on the lake. As Delane Cleveland reports, the city of Plymouth is trying to do something about it. Medicine Lake is considered by many to be the city of Plymouth's crown jewel. Hardy fishermen try to reel in the big one in the winter, and outdoor recreationists flock to it in the warm weather months. But later in the summer, water levels drop. So we can get late season evaporation, the, the precipitation patterns change, it's a drier time of year. Derek Ashey is the city of Plymouth's water resources manager. He says when water levels drop, it can impact recreation. In the past, uh, the city has not involved itself in projects where recreation is the specific goal and we're getting at that. Next we'll move on to item 8.02, consider Medicine Lake water level study. The topic was the subject of a lengthy discussion at Tuesday night Plymouth City Council meeting. The concern is really how do we provide for recreation in July, August, and September in a similar manner that we have in May and June or April, May and June. At issue was whether Plymouth should partner with the City of Medicine Lake to authorize $22,000 to fund a Medicine Lake water level study. The council raised a series of questions. Why are we looking now to get involved in this? And are we going to be doing this for every lake in the community? If we do the study, and we can figure out how to pay for it. What are we working towards? Meanwhile, Plymouth residents had their own concerns. I'm close enough to, ne to the lake to tell you it's not just a recreational issue. When that lake level goes down, it smells. And your our jewel begins to smell. Bottom line, it's an issue that's very much on the city's radar, but how to proceed from here and who will be involved will take work. There's a lot of different uh, groups that, that are really stakeholders in this issue. In Plymouth, Delane Cleveland, 12 News. Those stakeholders include the Army Corps of Engineers, the Department of Natural Resources, the Bassett Creek Watershed Commission, and the Three Rivers Park District. The next step for the council is a study session to determine what the city's role will be and whether to move forward.